Okay, here we are at the uh, Coconut Grove Marketplace. And this used to be the Outback. And Outback was here again. In other words, a long time businesses. But they didn't close anything having to do with Hawaii. They just had bad business practices that closed all over the, uh, all over the United States, including here in Hawaii. So, but good news is that we heard that uh, the employees were picked up by a second uh, a business that a second restaurant that will be coming in here shortly and so we're getting a good new restaurant coming in we just don't know what that restaurant's going to be but it is on the way so um, one of the things that's happened in Kona is um, a bays actually closed down during the holidays um, we were um, really excited when uh, they were able to keep it together um, after it turned out after the uh, volcano grill only be here for two months a bays actually was on fire and the young people especially enjoyed having live music here and um, the owner sadly passed away. Um, not too sure what's happening with the eight bays up in Waikoloa, but uh, this one is closed. And the good news is, is that we've heard that a um, successful um, restaurant tour from Hilo is bringing their idea over to this space. So not too sure of the time frame, but it's going to be something new and different. And uh, you guys are going to be able to get your drink once again, facing the ocean in Kailua. Okay, here's one more business that is closed. It's the Kona Ocean Front Gallery. And they had been here for like, man, it must have been like 20 years that they've been here, maybe even longer. Um, but they have... Uh, so sort of, I guess you'd say retired. And there is a new gallery coming in from Maui from what we hear, and they should be here as soon as they get all the permits and get everything else going. So a lot of transition here going on here at the businesses. In Kona. So here we are at one of our favorite stores in Kona, Tasty Kona, which specializes in bringing all these different local um, producers and craftsmen together. Um, and what we're gonna show you guys is that Maui Island Dive Jewelers came in to be part of the space um, because they have actually lost their gallery in Lahaina. And so they decided to move over here to Big Island for the time being, which actually, when Eric was showing you that gallery downtown also, those people are coming in from Maui as well. So we're starting to see a little bit more Maui business people coming over um, to uh, the same, basically, we don't have French Street, but at least we have this. We are in front of the old Uncle Billy's and uh, they have been slowly kind of working off and on for a long time. But we have some information we just thought we would partake about this. And that is the fact that they are going really slow because they're waiting on the permits to go through. And if you guys know the county permit permitting process, particularly for commercial is slow here in Kona. So that's probably why not much is happening. But uh, they are ready to go once they get the permits, they'll be able to get this going. And we look forward to that new rooftop restaurant that's gonna look out over the water. So that's uh, something to look forward to question is when it's going to be. We're not totally sure, but uh, it's good to see that something's going to happen. It's just a question of when.